Hi everybody, this is Annie. I'm a witness for Jesus Christ and I'm also, I am a prayer warrior. It is a beautiful day here in Fort Worth, Texas. I pray it is beautiful where you're at today. I love waking up and seeing the sun shining. Praise God, it's like a bridegroom coming out today. Praise God, hallelujah. And we are the bride for Jesus Christ that he is coming back for. So get your hearts prepared today. Be in the presence of Jesus today. Break off anything that tried to come against your mind and your body yesterday. Praise God. Hallelujah. We're going over the book of Proverbs in the contemporary English version. Praise God. I love the way the contemporary English version <clears throat> has their way of uh, making these verses just come to the point. <laughs> Praise God. So this is what it says. And I pray that one of these verses ministers to your heart today. The unfoolishness and of the unfaithfulness. Chapter 7. My son, pay close attention and don't forget what I tell you to do. Obey me and you will live. Let my instructions be your greatest treasure. Keep them at your fingertips and write them in your mind. Let wisdom be your sister and make common sense your closest friend. They will protect you from the flattering words of someone else's wife. From the window of my house, I once opened to see some foolish young men. It was late in the evening, sometime after dark, one of these young men turned the corner and was walking by the house of an unfaithful wife. She was dressed fancy like a woman of the street with only one thing in her mind. She was one of those women who are loud and restless and never stay at home. She uh, who walks street after street waiting to trap a man. She grabbed him and kissed him and with no sense of shame, she said, I had to offer a sacrifice and there is enough meat left over for a feast. So I came looking for you and here you are. The sheets on my bed are bright colored cloth from Egypt and I have covered it with a perfume made of mirth, aloes, and cinnamon. Let's go there and make love all night. My husband is traveling and he is far away. He took a lot of money along and he won't be back home before the middle of the month. And so she tricked him and all of her sweet talk and her flattery. Right away he followed her like an ox on the way to be slaughtered or like a fool on the way to be punished and killed with arrows. He was no more than a bird rushing into a trap without knowing it would cost him his life. My son, Pay close attention. My son, pay close attention. My son, pay close attention. Don't even think about it. That kind of woman or let or let yourself be misled by someone like her. Such a woman is caused the downfall and destruction of a lot of men. Her house is a one-way street leading straight down to the world of the dead. In Jesus' name, praise God. Guard your eyes. It is the window of your soul. God gave us two ears and one mouth. Keep your mouth shut and your ears wide open. Sit in the presence of the Lord today. Let him correct your heart. Minister to your heart this morning. Praise him and worship him and be so glad that you are content and you love the wife that God created you to be with. Praise God. Hallelujah. I love you. He loves us even more. Love wisdom today. Keep wisdom close to you today. Let her be your sister. I love you. Jesus Christ is Lord and our souls are well. Bye now.